How you doing, YouTube? Today is Thursday, December 10th, 2013. I'm coming to you with a... Let's see, one, two, four-day recap. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Actually, not Wednesday. I was shut out, actually, on Wednesday. Got nothing in, but this is my first opportunity to uh, make a video to show you the last few days. So, let's just get started. This is coming from North Texas. This took five days. This guy is always a super, super fast signer. Get to him. I just happened to have two cards I was going through in my um, baseball uh, boxes. Came across. I said, oh yeah, he's a fast signer. This is Brad Arnberg. Signed one. And I'll show you the same cards because he signed two of the same cards. So, from Massachusetts to Texas and back. Five days. Signed two of two. Pretty good time. Next. This is coming in 12 days. It's another card I had laying around. This is an oldie. It's a 1968 Tofts. Signed in 12 days from Milwaukee. This is Sal Bando. I have his son Chris, who is 87 Tofts. I think he has a card, so put those together. It's a nice father-son combination. Next. This is coming in 12 days from Fort Myers, Florida. Uh, this guy has signed for me about three times. I keep coming across cards, and I keep sending them, and he keeps signing. This is Michael Tucker. Um, I remember I sent it to a indoor batting cage facility down in Florida that he's a, a teacher at. All right, next. This is coming from Operation CEO. This is coming from the FedEx Corporation, which is number 70 on the Fortune 500 list. And I didn't get a signed business card, but I did get a nice letter. And he actually wrote a nice letter to say that he doesn't sign, but he wrote it in a nice way. And he wrote, basically wrote, you know, regrettably, I must respect the decline to participate. He, refer, he prefers to give the credit for the success of FedEx to the over 300,000 team members worldwide who strive to deliver outstanding service on a daily basis. Um, that's basically him saying, you know, I don't sign because it's just not me. It's everyone else who makes this company great, which is fine. You know, it's a nice way. I'm not saying, hey, I'm too busy. I got better things to do, which I kind of like the way he wrote that letter because I've gone a couple others saying I'm just too busy. I don't do it. You know, it's against company policy, blah, blah. Next one. This is coming from another CEO, Sprint. This one took 21 days. This is number 90 on the Fortune 500 company. Got my letter back, but this comes from Daniel Hesse. Sent me a signed business card. Yeah. Next, another CEO. This is coming from David Coote. Coat from Honeywell, which I I just got this in. I haven't recorded it yet, so I don't know what number it is. But let me sign card. But he sent me a handwritten um, note in his writing, signed by him. On the the company's um, letter has this Andy. I am hopefully a, a, a new a new. Oh, I am hopefully now a proud member of your collection. Um. David. So, we're a guy that's a Fortune 500 company. Probably doesn't get a lot of fan mail for business cards, so he sent a nice signed letter, which is I will take. Glad he took the time out to actually send me a write out a letter and send it to me. Next, this is coming another CEO from Michael McAllister. It's human, humina business card, but he signed it on the back. Which is nice. It's another one that I haven't recorded yet, so I don't know what number they are on the Fortune 500. Oh, here comes another one. This is on the really rolling. Um, I'm very happy about this. This is coming from Mass Mutual Financial Group. This is Roger uh, Cornell. And they are number 21 on the Fortune 500. This is the back of the card. It has all the uh, companies. Let me sign the front of it. Uh, there it is. 
so I'm happy with that one. It's another uh, Fortune 500 success. Here's another one. Number, this took 11 days, and it's number 129 on the list. This is Manpower Group, Jeffrey Juris. Juris. Sorry, Kaz, I can't freaking pronounce a goddamn thing today. Jeez. Let me see if we're focusing that. Maybe not. So, there's another one. So again, they are starting to really roll in. I sent them out like a week before Christmas and um, right around the New Year. So I know a lot of guys are busy with the holiday season. So I'm supposed to be just catching up now. Next, this took 196 days. Baseball success. This is coming from Kevin Brown. And no, it's not the first million dollar player, pitcher, Dodgers, Kevin Brown. This is coming from Milwaukee Brewers pitcher, Kevin Brown. Sign one and sign two. Back in the day, I did get the good. Well, this guy is good too, but the the pitcher Kevin Brown, I got him TTM way back. But next, this is a Olympic success. This took about ninety days. This is Tatiana McFadden. It's listed for athletics. That's not focusing on the right thing I got. There you go. I like these Olympic cards a lot. I'm a 2012 tops. No prep. Send them. They come back great. I think I had one that was a little iffy on the smudge because I used a weird ass pen. All right. Next, this is a World War II pilot success, which is a little unusual because I purchased this picture just thinking it's a World War II fighter plane. I know there's probably 10 different fighter planes in World War II plus, so not everyone flew this particular plane, but I wasn't great. I just sent that out anyways just to see. This guy, this is uh, Phil Kisabaron. Again, can't pronounce the name. Uh, he wrote me a nice letter back saying that he didn't fly this plane. He's a Navy pilot who... Navy carrier pilot who flew uh, Hellcats and um, another one. <laughs> I can't read it. Um, and he only likes to sign pictures of Navy aircraft. But he said, you know what? Um, he wrote a nice letter. I'll sign it anyways. Uh, this, let's see what he wrote. This, this is on an Air Force fighter, and I normally not for Navy pilots to sign. Well, he said Navy pilots aren't supposed to be signing this, but he did it anyways. And this is number three on this picture, and he wrote it huge on it. He's up in the top, so I looked Phil. I mean, he took up <laughs> probably a fifth of the picture. And then I got uh, two other guys. I like the guy that wrote really small about the wing, because now I can fit more. But he just took up so much space on it. But, oh, I just noticed it has a big crease on the bottom now. Uh, but, you know, I like sending it to, I'm a military kind of guy. I love sending out to military guys in the past. Guys, pieces of history, the brave. But um, I'm glad I got that one back. So, that's my video for today. Uh, hopefully, um, this weekend, Friday, Saturday, get um, more of the CEO project back. And I'm almost done getting them all out. I have about 200 more that I've prepped up. I just have to stuff them and record them and send them out. I just haven't had them time to do it but um, once I can do that then I can move on to the other projects that uh, me and Stacy and a couple other guys have decided to do but uh, hope everyone's well have a good day